So real quick, can you tell me your name and spell it for you? Chaim Telsner, C-H-A-I-M-T-E-L-S-N-E-R. Okay, and what is your uh, role? I'm the director here of Chabad at ISU. Okay. And uh, obviously it's been a year since tour this is since those terrible events, 139 people, mostly Israeli, mostly civilians, were murdered, 250 uh, were kidnapped. What are your feelings like today? Pain, lots of pain. You know, you have your own siblings sitting in captivity. Jewish people are one nation, so your own siblings are sitting in captivity. So don't forget about it. Um, how do you feel that Netanyahu has been prosecuting the war? I don't, well, I, my job here is to add light. I don't deal with politics. Nobody asks my opinion. He doesn't ask my opinion. I don't vote in Israel. I'm an American citizen, so I, I don't give an opinion on what other people, what people, what Netanyahu does, what other people do. I, let them do what they got to do. I'm not in a position to give an opinion, to have an opinion. Okay, um, do you support any type of ceasefire agreement? Absolutely. Once we have all the hostages back and all the terrorists uh, give up their arms, when Israel is, when the Jewish people are safe, which means that the, entire, that the terrorists are eliminated, absolutely. I mean, we had a ceasefire before, October 7th. And uh, as long as, once we have all our hostages back, and all terrorists eliminated? Absolutely. You, so you don't support a ceasefire to get the hostages back? Because I don't believe that's a that's no such option. So, I mean, 95% of all the hostages that have been returned alive were through right now, there's hostage no, there's, there's or no, There has never been a deal on the, on the table to return all the hostages for a ceasefire. It never happened. And uh, I don't, we don't negotiate Well, there was terrorists. one in November. Not not with all the terrorists, absolutely not. Well, not with everybody. Thank you. So well, I should choose some over the other? Take, take out 30 and the other 70 should be killed? We never allow that. That's not called a ceasefire. That's called a murder. Okay. There's never been a ceasefire. It's all a hoax. There's never been any de any any deal on the table to return the hostages for a ceasefire. There's been to return some hostages, and therefore, and that would be automatically a death sentence to the rest of the hostages. That's not called a ceasefire. That's called killing hostages with an excuse of making you feel good because you let out a couple of hostages. So that's called murder. That's not called a ceasefire. Okay. Have you experienced an increase of anti-Semitism on the campus? Uh, not particularly. No. Do you know anybody who has? Yes, there are students who have had it here and there. Heard it. Can you describe any experiences that you've heard? Or They've had like the that? harassment and, and, and social media bullying and, and stuff like that. Okay. Um, do you, so obviously the national elections are coming up. Who do you think would be better for Israel? I don't Trump talk about that. Okay. I hope I don't. Uh, I don't believe that. Uh, I don't. I don't talk about that. Okay. That's all the questions I have. Thank you very much.